This afternoon, high winds caused some unexpected damage across the area. A small plane flipped over in the suburbs, and here in Lincoln Park, a roof caved in. There was uh, a slight collapse of the building in the center of the building from the uh, HVAC unit. As heavy rain moved through the area, the Goldfish Swim School in Lincoln Park took an unexpected hit. Our companies quickly established collapse zones and evacuated the building. Fire officials were called around 3 p.m. One person was inside but wasn't hurt. Goldfish Swim School quickly taking to Facebook, writing that the day's lessons were canceled. It looked like we had some roofing material that was blown off. Possibly taking down some power lines, gas lines, and also some uh, HVAC units on the roof. ComEd was on the ground for hours, and fire officials say it's possible the passing storm is to blame. It was a heavy thunderstorm that was going through with some high winds, so it is possible, but again, uh, even with that, it's under investigation. Near Midway, neighbors are just beginning to clean up. A power pole snapped, and at least one car lost the battle to Mother Nature. As soon as I came out, I saw all this mess. My electricity's out, half of my fence is out. In the western suburbs at the DuPage Airport, two people were on board a single-engine Cessna aircraft when high winds caused it to overturn. The Federal Aviation Administration is investigating. Most recent flight logs show the plane taking off and landing at DuPage Airport, but the four-seater plane is registered to Wings Leasing, a company based in Wichita, Kansas. At DuPage Airport, wind speeds were recorded at 55 miles per hour. It's unclear if those passengers were injured. We've reached out to the West Chicago fire officials for more information. And here in Lincoln Park, we still don't know just how bad the damage is inside the swim school or how long it will take before they can reopen. Reporting live in Lincoln Park, Casey Cronus, Fox 32, Chicago.